The learning objectives for TR-05 are know the definition of radian and use the arc length equations to solve problems. So, what is a radian? A radian is the size of the central angle that subtends an arc length equal to the radius. Here's the diagram that tells the story. You should see this relationship in your head without struggling. If the angle is more than one radian, then the arc length is more than one radius. If the angle is less than one radian, then the arc length is less than one radius. If the angle is x radians, the arc length will be x radii. The following problems should help. What's the arc length subtended by angle theta? Well, we should always start by writing down our formula. In this case, we want to solve for arc length s, so we don't need to manipulate the equation. Theta is 2.1 radians, and the radius is 3.8 millimeters. So we can plug these values right in. The answer is 8.0 millimeters. Notice that radians times millimeters is millimeters, since radians is a unitless measure. What angle subtends the arc length? Start with the arc length formula. In this case, we're asked to find the angle, so we'll isolate theta to solve for the angle. Plug in the arc length and radius, then divide to get 1.2 radians. What's the circumference of the circle? Well, our formula S equals theta R doesn't include circumference, but it does include radius. And if we know the radius, we can find the circumference. So let's find the radius. Here we're given the angle, 2.3 radians, and the arc length that subtends, 3.9 meters. Write the equation with R isolated so we solve for the radius. Plug in the arc length and angle in radians, and we get 1.7 meters. Remember, we were asked for the circumference, not the radius, so we can't stop here. A circle's circumference is 2 pi times its radius, so we multiply 1.7 meters times 2 pi to get 10.7 meters. And that's our answer. Here's one to make sure you aren't falling asleep. What do the symbols in the arc length formula mean? S, theta, and R. First, the one or two word meaning. S means arc length, theta means central angle, and R means radius. But can you describe each variable in terms of the other two? These aren't going to be test questions. Your instructor isn't going to ask you for these descriptions, but you should know and understand these. So consider this a little bonus lecture. S is the arc length subtended by a central angle theta on a circle of radius R. Theta is the central angle that subtends an arc length s on a circle of radius r. And r is the radius of a circle whose central angle theta subtends arc length s. The relationship between these concepts should be very familiar to you. Here's one last problem. The angle theta isn't in standard position, but our equation will still work. We're asked for theta, so we write our equation with theta isolated. The radius is 1, and the subtended arc length is 1. S divided by R is 1 unit over 1 unit. We use the word unit since we aren't given specific units of measure in the problem statement or diagram. So theta equals 1 radian. This matches our definition of 1 radian, the angle that subtends an arc length of 1 radius.